Welcome everyone, here is how you use the home button in your iPhone 14 Pro. So I want to cover going home with a swipe gesture first, then I'll show you how to put a virtual home button on the screen of your device. So in order to just go home regularly, you open up an app in question, you're going to see either a black or white bar, and you just want to flick with your finger, and once you finish the flick motion, you're going to release your finger from the screen, okay? Boom. Okay, I'm just flicking up and releasing once I finish the motion. Once you get used to this, you'll find this is way better than having a virtual button on the screen. But again, I will show you how to do that. And if you're wondering to access multitasking, instead of flicking and releasing, you're going to do the same flick motion, but you're going to hold. And once you feel vibration on the back of your device, you release, okay? And eventually, you should be able to get this down every single time. Go home, flick release, flick release, flick and hold, flick and hold. So that may take some time to get used to, depending on you know how old you are, how tech savvy you are. But once you learn, you know how to go home or to task, it's going to be nice and easy. However, if you're having issues, or you just don't want to learn the gestures. I don't blame you. Uh, I'm going to show you how to add the home button uh, virtually on your iPhone screen. Let's go. The first step is you're going to open up the settings app. From here, you're going to scroll all the way down until you see accessibility. From here, you want to find where it says touch. You're then going to see here assistive touch. Tap on this one. And now turn on assistive touch. So by default, we have this button here, but it's not a home button, okay? So in order to fix this, you're going to see custom actions. Tap on single tap. Select home. Go back. And now when we use a single tap, we go home. Tap on double tap. Select none. Tap on long press and select none. Now, when you tap the button, you go home. You double tap to access multitasking. And if Siri is on when you long press this button right here, it will activate Siri as well. You can also drag and drop this button around as you please. I do recommend you watch my tutorial on how to use the gestures as that is better than the home button, which will be in the description. With that being said, thanks for watching. Support the channel by buying any product on Amazon using my affiliate link in the description. Bye-bye.